Hole number one, option one, we are starting with a headwind, and we are starting with the rock and a P6 ball, a P6 max stretch. Now I'm looking at the right side of uh, my clear and white train. So I do want the fringe line where the fringe meets the green to be where the clearing just is. So the white train just outside, for an example, or you clearing just by, depending on how you look at it, things. This is in between the yellow and the red angle, sorry, yellow and the blue angle. We are adjusting a custom based adjustment. And for those um, to know the values here, it's uh, pretty uh, specific in the winds that is 7.2 to 7.8 miles per hour. We are doing 72% slider with so much as you can see here, 10% elevation, P zero numbers. And where it comes to the winds that is 7.9 to 8.6 miles per hour, then we are playing 84% slider plus 10% elevation P0 numbers. And to break that down into value for Apocalypse level 8, 7.2 to 7.8 miles per hour is 1 to 1 minus 1.1. And in 7.9 to 8.6 is 1 to 1 minus 1. And obviously, you can't play those one-to-one -one measurements if you play Apoc 7, 6, or 5. And the reason we do have to play with Apocalypse is due to the fact that we do have a headwind. Here, you can play with a Power 8 ball uh, if uh, you do um, not pull above plus 23 yards. So make sure to pay attention to that. So I would recommend to adjust with a Power 10 um, wind 10 ball. And then, if so, swap to a P8 ball after you have made your adjustment, if you see the plus yardage is not uh, as high as it could be. Scan the QR code here on the screen or go directly to patreon.com slash golfclashtommy for the ultimate tournament text guide for the Open 2024 tournament.